Character profile of Mrs. Berlin from an inspector calls with Mrs. Potts from the Net English director team. Sybil Berlin is introduced as a rather cold woman and her husband's social superior. Like Gerald Croft, she is upper class and well bred. The adjective cold is symbolic for how she abuses her power and mistreats Eva in a very cold manner. Like Mr. Berlin, Sybil does not accept responsibility. In Act 1, Sybil accepts the gender divide as she and Sheila retire to the drawing room, leaving the men to discuss business. She also accepts that business is often a priority to men and not their relationship. She has had a capitalist education and does not question social standards. In Act 2, Mrs. Berlin's prejudice is shown when she says girls of that class and Sheila attempts to warn her of the wall she has built up. We see Sybil's naivety when she is shocked at Alderman Megadie's disgusting behaviour at the Palace Bar. Sybil was the last character to see Eva Smith and refused to help. Mrs Berlin is a prominent member of a woman's charity, but instead of helping Eva, she metaphorically slams the door in her face, leaving her with no options. Sybil felt Eva's case was undeserving and was prejudiced because she used the name Berlin. To Sybil, the name Berlin is a symbol of wealth and status and shouldn't be associated with the working class. She believed Eva only had herself to blame and didn't believe that a girl of that sort would ever refuse money. Like her husband, Sybil shows no compassion to Eva and chooses to not understand her penniless and lonely situation. Sybil is so self-righteous that she even shifts the blame from herself onto the young idler responsible for Eva's pregnancy. Little does she know that Eric is the father when she states that he needs to be made an example of. When Sybil realises, she is frightened for the first time of the repercussions of Eva's death. In Act 3, Eric clashes with his mother and blames her for the death of her own grandchild, while Sybil states that she is absolutely ashamed of Eric. It is clear there is a divide between the younger and older generation. Just like Mr Berlin, Sybil praises Gerald for discovering the truth about Goo and is also described as triumphant. Sybil is criticised throughout the play and continues to symbolise capitalism, ignorance and promotes a divided society. She will be taught in fire, blood and anguish. <laughs>